For most of us, we have interacted with TV only as consumers. But what if there was a way to make our own TV station to play whatever we want? I'm 99% sure you're watching this video and have thought the same thing before. Are you ready to create a homemade TV channel with a Raspberry Pi? There are three main parts to this. A Raspberry Pi, VLC media player, and a Channel Plus video distribution system. The setup's simple. We start with the Raspberry Pi. We install VLC on the Pi with sudo apt install VLC. With VLC installed, we can play videos stored locally on the Pi, the video and sound being outputted through the HDMI port or the 3.5mm jack. This is where the Channel Plus comes in. The Channel Plus accepts AV video input on one side and outputs a TV channel over coax on the other. Note that the two photos are referencing the same device, where the photo on the left and right show the respective sides of the Channel Plus device. The Channel Plus sits in the middle of our TV system. The Raspberry Pi is on the left side and connects to the Channel Plus with a 3.5mm jack to AV converter. On the right side, we're able to take a coax cable with our TV channel and connect it to any TV of our choice. Although this is optional, I incorporated a TV splitter and amplifier into the system. This was so that I could reach more than just the three TVs that the Channel Plus was able to supply. Furthermore, it also ensures that the signal remains strong for each TV it's connected to. It's time to wire things up. I first mounted the amplifier and splitter to a piece of plywood I painted black. The next step was mounting the Channel Plus beneath it, followed by the Raspberry Pi. To mount the Raspberry Pi to the wall, I 3D printed a case, which consisted of three parts and had holes for screws to mount on a wall. A link to the case is in this video's description. I then connected the 3.5mm jack to AV to the Pi and the Channel Plus. After that, I connected an Ethernet cable to the Pi as well as the power cable. Next, I added a coax cable between the amplifier and the Channel Plus. I then connected all of the coax cables of various TVs to the amplifier and powered on the Channel Plus and amplifier. When configuring the TV channel number for the Channel Plus, the device has buttons on the top for which channel you want, specifying the tens digit first and then the ones digit. For example, I wanted channel 66. To specify it, Now that things are up and running, let's set up VLC. It's important to note that for newer TVs, you may need to tune your cable signal to analog for the channel to appear. Alright, now it's time to SSH into a Raspberry Pi which is on a network. So from Linux, Mac, or Windows, the command's the same. It's just SSH Pi at the IP address it's at. So for mine, it's 192.168.1.31. It'll prompt you to enter the password. And then once we're in, um, you can download videos to your Raspberry Pi however you want. I have a directory called videos, so if I hop in there. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you the VLC command right now that you need. So it's VLC dash dash loop dash I dummy. And then the name of the video that you want. So I'm gonna do this video by vector graphics dash dash quiet. VLC colon quit. On my newer TV, you can see I'm on channel 66 for coax. Same output. One last test on the other TV I have. Right now, I'm on channel 64. You can see this at the top. Channel 65 doesn't work. If I go to channel 66. If you want to keep this running in the background, what you can do is while still on the Raspberry Pi terminal, do control Z. It'll stop the process and to start it in the background, detached from the terminal, just type BG1. After doing BG1, one last command you have to enter is disown. After doing so, you can sign out of the Raspberry Pi and your TV station will continue to broadcast. Also, if you want to run a list of videos on a loop, bring back the old command. Just change this section with the example mp4 file that I used 
to a directory of videos that you want to loop. And there you have it, a TV channel that we have full control over, playing whatever we want to our heart's content.